So, um, <laughs> let's play a game. This game is called Elevator. Um, Elevator, yeah, right? It's not Genshin, it's called Elevator. Um, I don't know much about this game. I do not know anything about this game. I purposely wanted to make sure. Uh, maybe I should turn it down a little bit. Hey, right. so I do not know much about this game at all. Probably going to show hentai. Hopefully not. That would suck. <laughs> that would that would be, that that would suck, right? Uh, so <laughs> odd, odd. What the frick? Um, but yeah, no. Hopefully it doesn't show this. But I don't know anything about this game. But it looks interesting, and it's a cute waifu on the cover. So we're going to try it. Let's play this game. I don't know how long it is. I don't even know what this game really is. But we're going to try it. Let's try it. Nice to meet you, stranger. Let me welcome you to the elevator. I'm the elevator girl. I'll be your assistant for today. Before anything else, I'll advise you to keep your hands away from the walls and not to move around too much. I like the music though. Spell all over the place. Uh, I kind of like the music. The company won't pay for any injuries that might occur on the way down, so please be careful. Um, <laughs> in the past, we've had issues with lost limbs stuck in the mechanic. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if I should want. I don't know if I should be on this elevator, guys. I know I should be on this elevator. Not a pretty sight, as you imagine. Also, very expensive to clean up. Ah, uh, you know what? I imagine so. Imagine so. But don't worry. If you stay perfectly still, the chain chances of something going wrong are less than fifty percent. Should I go on this elevator? It doesn't sound very safe. I don't know. Can I just chill with the girl? Can I just chill with her? She's adorable. She's really adorable. Now, please don't be impatient, dear stranger. Dear stranger. This is a very long trip. Hopefully not too long. Let's take this chance to get to know each other. Ooh. I'll let you know once we are near our first stop. Oh yeah, the side of her face looks kind of weird though. Oh, hello, she got closer. She's cute. Guys, like, she's cute, right? I think she's kind of cute. So for now, please relax and enjoy my company. I will definitely enjoy your company. The elevator. Cool. So this is the game, the elevator. You made the anime quiz thing with channel points smart. Yes, I actually thought it would be a really good idea to try it out. I thought it would be really cool. Thank you, thank you. Alright, so. Elevator girl is kind of thick. Dude, she's very thick. I like. Nice. Very nice indeed. Alright, let's check, the, let's check her out. Um, oh, I have choices. We've been going for a while, so where are we going? What do you guys, what should we ask? One, two, or three, guys. In the chat, one, two, or three. You have to give me credit for the quiz 50%. No, true. Three, two, all right. We got to split, we got to split. I kind of like three, though. I kind of like three. Just because, like, I kind of just want to enjoy her thing. Four? Kirby, what the frick? There's no third answer. I kind of like I kind of like three though I kind of like three. Um, yeah, I, I'm thinking I'm gonna go for three for this one because I kind of want to enjoy her company. I don't want to say anything. Let's enjoy her company. This is enjoy her company. Let's enjoy it. Let's enjoy it. There is no four. I just like enjoy. Okay, one or two guys, one or two there. One or two. Wanna keep enjoying her company? Or do you wanna actually per do you wanna say something in the story? Do you wanna like prolong the story? What do you guys wanna do? Sad Kerbo. You yes, don't be sad. Don't be sad. There was no fourth answer. I don't think that was a fourth answer. I don't think so. 
Can I talk? I can't tap anything else, really. Uh, two? Alright, we're gonna do two, guys? We're gonna do two? Give me another two. Just pick three. There's no three! There's no three! What are you talking about? Odd, there's no three! Alright, let's pick two, okay? Let's pick two. No. So we're not even close. Alright, so what do we say next? I kind of want to... Like, she said we're not even close to the stop. So we might just want to just keep waiting, right? Just keep waiting. Let's, let's just keep waiting. What is this game? Like, is there anything to do with this game? Is just waiting and are we there yet? Can I like, click on a thing while... Oh, hey, we arrived to our first stop. Hey guys, look, we arrived at the first stop. Oh, hey, um, what's up, bro? Dude, <laughs> I feel like this is one of you guys. Bro, it's like they spent 90% of the budget on the maid and the actual game. You know what? They did a good job with the maid. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. Look, it's an old man, but he says, bro. Not getting ahead. Take your ticket and wait. We, we call this floor the waiting room. People that don't have the patience to endure the trip down are left here. They spend a long time wait here waiting for something, or perhaps waiting for nothing at all. All that clear is that they wait, they wait a lot, and a lot they wait. Yo, bro, I've been here a long time waiting for... Wait, what was I waiting for again? Oh no, is this because I asked if we were there yet? Anyway, bro, did the rubber boy ever find the single piece? I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, he was talking about One Piece. He was talking about One Piece, didn't he? Just yeah, he did. He talked about the one. He talked about the Robo talking about One Piece. Hey, look, see this anime related? Yeah, it was One Piece. That was cool. I was a big fan of that show, but Sally never got to see how it ended. It technically hasn't ended yet. I think they have gone to the Grand Line in the manga. I think. Can't remember though. Of course, people that leave here can't get into the elevator again. That's a no-go. Oh, snap. You can't go back to the elevator? It didn't end. I know. It hasn't really ended yet. Elevator? What's that? Anyway, I'm back to waiting. Have a nice day. Have a nice day, you both. I'm glad I didn't get out. Well, I don't think this is your stop, so let's keep going deeper and deeper, shall we? Alright, okay, so I guess we're just waiting. The next stop is still a few minutes away. So I guess we'll just wait. Do you want to chat for a bit? Yeah, I do. I want to chat with her. Guys, let's let's chat. Let's chat it up with Wade. Wait, wait, wait. Um, I was reading a story earlier. You probably heard about it. It's a very popular one. Hey guys, can we guess the story? Can we guess the story? The tale of the tortoise and the hare. Okay, so is this entire elevator you young? He is young. I have a lot of young people watching my streams for some reason. I get. I'm blaming Super Smash Bros. Hey, right, tail of the tortoise and the hare. Well, in case you don't remember it, it goes some somewhat like this. There was once a tortoise and a hare that decided to have a race between them. The hare would often mock the tortoise for being so slow. So when the day of the race come, and the hare easily outpaced the tortoise and got close to the finish line in no time. Seeing the slow pace of the tortoise, the hare got cocky and decided to take a nap, as it was impossible that the tortoise would ever catch up but then the hare slept for so long that the tortoise managed to slowly but steadily get to the finish line and beat the hare be like a good boy quite the sh great story don't you think it's easy to draw parallels in real life there are many hares and tortoises out there now tell me stranger would you consider yourself a hare or a tortoise I I can't focus on the story because I see two melons moving too much. Ah, it's not, it's not really that big. Not, it's not like uh, Lady Demetris is from uh, Resident Evil. How am I in melons? Not you. Kirby is not talking about you. It's talking about the maid lady chick right here. 
All right, um, so what are we guys? Are we a tortoise or are we hare? I want to say I'm a tortoise because I can chill. I can wait. I'm in no hurry. I'm in no hurry in my life. The tortoise, huh? The story was constructed in such a way to make the tortoise appear to be the hero. But in but I disagree with that. No notion. The tortoise is just as bad as the hare. If you are hard working, you'll put in the effort to always be on top. You wouldn't let yourself go so much that you become the lavy stock of everyone else. I'm pretty true, pretty true. Furthermore, the tortoise's victory was a fluke that relied on the hare's incompetence, not the tortoise's effort. Like, pretty true. She's actually spitting facts. I actually like this. What is this conversation going to be? I don't know. They are both incredibly lazy. I don't know. Like, I want to say the the tortoise is, is lazy. I just think that, um, I just don't think that he just works the same kind of like there's different kinds of work you know like the hare worked really hard to be a hare and be fast and the turtles worked really hard to try to beat a challenge but like they are also lazy in their own way too but that heart well hare and tortoises it does not matter i'm sure our next work <clears throat> I'm sure our next floor will be an interesting to you. Will be interesting. JK, JK. What? <laughs> Alright, let's see what the next... Let's see what the next floor is. You guys ready? Floor 13. Oh, here we are. Okay, right, so floor 13. Let's see what it is. It was a joke. I don't know. I got you. I got you. I got you. Alright, it's... uh Ooh. The factory? Let me welcome you to the factory. The factory is the pride and joy of our company. Ah. We make everything here from jewelry to installations and firearms. It's all here. Our systems are automatic too and the robots handle all the work so being one of our employees is extremely easy. So being being one of our employees is extremely easy. Do you think she's a robot? I think she's a robot. Don't bonk me. I don't know if I could bonk. I would definitely bonk. I asked you about to. I asked you about the whole, the hare and the tortoise earlier because you seemed lazy to me. I think I was right. What? Why is she being so mean to me? I want to make you an offer. We're currently hiring, and we need someone just like you. Someone to do absolutely nothing. Um. Um. What do you guys think? Do we should should we end it here or should we keep going? I'll pass or hire me. I kind of want to pass. I don't want to do this job. Because I'm not really a worker that does things like easy. I don't like working at jobs that are too easy. I like having challenges in my job. So I don't really like to do... I don't want to do a job where I don't do anything. You know, I don't like that kind of job. I like to improve and get better and keep doing things. So I'm going to pass. I'm going to pass on this one. You don't want to work for us. Pass. Yes, agree. I pass. I pass. You don't want to work for us? I don't want to work for you. I'm sorry. I do not want to work for you. That's such a shame. Well, maybe factory work isn't for you. Like, if I could be uh, closer to her, maybe I'll work here. But I don't want to prove that I'm lazy, so no. It's alright. It's alright. We have other positions too. Oh, um, maybe some other positions. Maybe, maybe. Maybe our next stop will be more to your liking. Ah, uh, check it out. I like the music too. It's nice to jamming. Oh yes. In the meantime, would you like to play a game? Guys, we're gonna play a game! Or aren't we already playing a game? But okay, let's play this game. Hey, it's on new slot machine prototype. How did I get there? What makes it different from other slot machines, are you wondering? Well, it's free to play. So feel free to give it as many attempts as you want. The win condition is to get three of the same numbers in a row. So I can do it as many times as I want. I'll let you do your thing. Please enjoy. What if I just don't play it? You know what I mean? What if I just don't play it? 
Again, it's not this whole thing is about being patient and working hard. You know, it seems like, you know, it seems like it's a game. This whole game is about like, you know, being patient and work hard for things you want. And this seems too easy, right? It seems too easy. I'm going to say leave. I'm going to say leave. Oh, you had enough of our slot machine already? I didn't even use it. It's a shame, but oh well. We'll arrive to the next stop in the moment. Oh, here we are. 23. I wonder if these are random. Alright, here we are. What the frick? What's her? This is the office. Uh, she doesn't look like she's really enjoying herself too much. This is where our most brilliant of Mish's <laughs> employees work. As opposite to the fact that this place isn't automatic and you get paid according to the amount of effort you put in. Ah, I kind of like that. You like, I like that. I like that. You get paid by the amount you put into it. Um, I do like the idea, but that also determines on how much money you get paid. Because if you get paid really well by how much work you put into it, then that's definitely main for it. Also, it de also depends on what is considered as a hard work, you know? So it does, there's a lot of differences between that. Employees of the office are an integrated part of the development of the company. Creating new products that later get made in the factory and new ideas to improve productivity. Salaries here start at 100k US per hour? Wow. Huh, a newbie? You should definitely join us. In fact, you should work under me. Ah uh, yes, if you enter as an apprentice of someone, your senior will get a portion of your income in exchange for mentorship. Ah. I work 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. I also have over 200 uh, applicants. I'm probably one of the richest people in the world right now. Keep, 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 keep. I love that. But that's not enough. I need more. Need more. Come, my princess. With the help, I will be able to get to the absolute top. Um, it sounds like she's not doing so well. Like, I know, that's... Like, she seems very greedy, you know? I'll become the CEO of this company, and then I'll fund new companies to become even richer. So join me. You won't regret it. I know, I kind of regret it because it seems like I'm only helping her out and not really helping myself. Because she has a lot of people, like, under her, and I, I guess the money doesn't satisfy her. Because so I guess, um, this might be a really interesting thing to think about. Because this has happened to me before, so... Money... Is such an interesting thing to talk about because personally, personally for me, money, I hate like currency. I hate it to no end. I don't like how it works because the way it works is that, um, is like, so I work a lot and I work even more now that I do streaming. So I work a lot, a lot, but I don't like really currency or money in this kind of sense, mostly because if I get a lot of money, by all the work I put into, I guess that's what this is all about. This is actually literally what this is all about. You can put a lot of work into it and get a lot of money, but the thing is, is that you also using up your own time. And you might have a lot of money, but you might not have any time to actually use the money. So you just have, you just sell a lot of money, but then you never use it. And you never go anywhere. And you never enjoy the money. You just, just live in this work vested kind of like kind of thing i know to me like what do you guys think are you guys pretty like okay with the whole like system in place where you can like work a whole bunch and make a whole bunch of money but then you never be able to use any of it so you just keep working for money like it, like this is a hundred percent a huge difference from the last room we ran into the last room we ran into um the whole game is about you know like getting a lot of money but not doing anything so you have too much time on your hands now this is you don't have any time on your hands but you make a lot more money like what do you guys prefer do you guys prefer working a lot and getting a lot of money but never have time to get to use the money or would you rather work and not do anything but not make that much money but then you have a lot of time in your hands what do you guys prefer 
Like, to me, that's a really good question. Because, like, the whole premise is to like, kind of find a balance between the two. You know, make a lot of money, but also have free time to actually use the money. What do you guys think? I think that's a really interesting topic to go into. This game is very, very, like, psychological. Like, there's a lot of things to think about in this movie. This game. Sorry. Oops, actually, it went to the wrong one. I suppose. Ah, actually, no, this is perfect. This is perfect. Right, let's try it out. Please don't be so pushy with the stranger. Shut up, elevator girl. You'll see. In no time, you'll work for me too. You'll owe. I'll own you and your stupid elevator. Yes, you wait and see. We'll see about that. I definitely don't want to work there. I don't think that a stranger would be a good fit for you this floor anyway. Let's keep going deeper. At least I didn't have a choice in this one. I, I do agree with that kind of style. But also, I do think that... Um, I do agree that... Uh, that is a problem that's going on in the society. That either you work too much and not be able to use in the money for it. So the ideal job is to make a lot of money but not do that much work. That's like the ideal job. But I think if you put a lot of work, then you should get paid for it. But then there's the problem of working too much and not being able to use and the money that you made. And then you just kind of like hate life because you work so much. I know. It's really interesting. This is this 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 elevator thing is kind of cool. I like it. We should chat for a bit while we get to the next destination. What do you think of this descent thus far? I hope you are having a good time. I'm imagining enjoying this kind of ride that we have. It's very thoughtful. Very thoughtful. At the last stop, you'll surely wish to go back to the elevator, that's for sure. Hee <laughs> hee, never mind that. But it's all good. The company really appreciate people like you. Like, I, the only reason why I would come back to the elevator is because of her, so I don't know. Even so, you are excited for what we are looking for. You exactly what are we are looking for. I've been working here for over 50 years. Wow, she freaking looks amazing for being 50, over 50 years old. So, I know what I'm talking about. When I see someone with great big potential, I can definitely identify it so immediately. Uh, wording. Um, I'm okay at the cat. As as the elevator girl for you, I am too. I am too a great at my job. Oh, 69. What the frick? Oh, we finally arrived to our next stop. This floor is. Uh, actually, let's skip this floor, shall we? What? Why are we skipping this floor? What? Oh, I kind of want to see what that floor was. Darn it. Oh, I'm feeling kind of bad. I want to see the floor. Da 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 is my sing bothering you? This is a long trip down, so sometimes I get distracted. I'm sorry. Well, now that I think about it, you must be hungry right now, right? We happen to have a full course meal service at this elevator. So feel free to eat whatever you want. Hold up a second. I will bring you the menu. Hey, hey guys, let's eat some food. All right. Please choose the dish you like to eat. Tofu soup. I kind of like tofu. Because I like miso. I love miso soup. Beef stew is okay, but like it's very filling and very like, I don't know, like beef stew, I only like it if I'm like really starving, but I love miso soup and tofu is pretty good. So I'm gonna have tofu. I see good choice. Now for the main course. Oh, see, that's actually good because that's actually a light. That's very light. Salad or pork chops? I kind of like pork chops actually. I really like pork chops. And don't get me wrong, I like salad, but I like ranch on my salad. So it kind of defeats the purpose of salad, unfortunately. And there's like no ranch on this, so I'm getting pork chops. Another good choice. Finally, please choose your dessert. Uh, fruits or banana split? Um, I don't like banana splits actually. Um, because I don't, I don't like so this is kind of weird for me, but I actually don't like fruit with veg with uh, ice cream. It just tastes weird to me. You know, like fruit is good enough, and I love watermelons. Oh, I love watermelons. And there's grapes and bananas. Maybe it's a little too much fruit. Um, but I'd rather eat that than the banana split. Now, please enjoy your meal. 
This is an interesting game. A really interesting game. I don't know how long this is, but it's really good. Hope that was tasty. Can't help but notice that you, s you selected some dishes that uh, contain animal products. Yep, I did. It was pork chops. It was delicious. I hope you're aware that animals had to die to say uh, to date your hunger. True. Um, yeah. It was delicious. <laughs> If you are the type of person that enjoys inflicting pain upon creatures you deem inferior to you, that's very unfortunate. But I'm sure you're very aware of the death all around you, right? You only eat other creatures to survive, not for pleasure, am I right? Actually, to think about it, I actually only eat to... Uh, enjoy it actually so it actually is for pleasure to tell the truth because the reason why I can never go vegan or vegetarian is because I just love steak so much I think steak tastes freaking amazing like I can't eat vegetables and I do enjoy a lot of vegetables but I just enjoy steak so much more so it actually is very pleasure is actually unfortunately well but enough about the food let's chat for a bit more still a long way to go a question, do you have pets? I do, I have a little cat. I do, I do have pets. I see, so think enslaving animals is okay, noted. Oh my god, this girl's being so mean to me, oh my god. I'm not enslaving him, and you know, he, so my cat is living the life of luxury. If anything, I'm being enslaved by him. Because mother effer, like, all he has to do is sleep, and then I feed him. I'm buying all the food. Like, I'm not enslaving any pet. Like, this guy is enslaving me. What the frick? I'm definitely not enslaving anyone. <laughs> hmm, next question. Imagine you were on a deserted island with a starving old man and a cute puppy. You just had a full course meal and have one apple left. Would you give the apple to the old man or the cute puppy? Well, I think... So, yeah, puppies can't eat apples. So I pop and it says starving old man. I probably give it to the old man. Oh, I can eat the apple. Just eat it. Oh my god, it's messed up. I'll give it to the old man. Uh, because he's starving, you know? So give him something. The dog, unfortunately, he seems fine to me. I see. Ah. Next scenario. You are stranded on a mountain in winter with your kitten. Oh my cat! Oh no! At this rate, you'll be the first one to die. If your kitten eats your remains, it might survive. I hope my cat doesn't eat my remains. I think it would just die also. I think he probably die before I do. You accept the death in this case. Or would you kill your kitten for food? I'll just I'll accept death. Like like I'm sorry, if I'm found in the middle of the forest with my cat, I'm not in a good position and I'm probably gonna die anyway. And I'm pretty sure the cat's not going to help me out. At least this way my cat can like live a little bit longer. But I don't really care too much, but I don't. I see. Final question. Oh, she looks so cute. I love how cute she is. Would you give your tongue in exchange for leaving this elevator? No, I don't want No. Oh. I like my tongue. Understandable. I don't want to leave the elevator. I want to still chill with her. She's cute. We have arrived. 250. Oh my god. This floor. Ugh, what the frick is this? Oh my god. That's the kitchen? This is the kitchen? Did I eat the food from this thing? Oh my god, it's so freaking nasty. Our employees work hard to provide food for everyone in the company. Mmm, that visitor looks very tasty. I'm in vain. Why don't you join the kitchen? We have nice food here. I'm in pain. Yeah, yeah, this kitchen is very nice and look, I won't sugarcoat it. The food comes from them, alright? Uh the cat keeps on dropping all my stuff on the floor. Um comes from them, alright? I'm in pain. Come on, come on. Just just a bite. It won't hurt. I don't know. I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one, guys. No, you ain't deserving of the kitchen. People like you deserve to go even deeper. I have a bad feeling about this. Shall we continue, stranger? 
feel like this is the metaphor for hell, you know? Like, like that was gluttony. Maybe we went through some other, like, stages of hell or something like that. Like, sloth, um, pride. This might be just all the stages of hell that we're going through. I know you have many questions right now, but I'm legally, I'm legally allowed to not answer any of them. Just trust me for now, I'll find you the best floor for you. This is 100% hell, and we're going down all the different levels of hell. And she's trying to find the best place to put me at for hell. Which kind of sucks, because... Yeah, this kind of sucks, because... If we're going to go deeper, we're going to go into worse and worse parts. As I said before, our company really likes having people like you on board. I wouldn't let you go to waste. Oh my god, this is this this story is getting, getting kind of scary now. <clears throat> four, four, five. Ah, never pleases to come to this one. Uh, pleasant to come to this one. He is a floor, I guess. Um. Oh. Um. I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's some creepy things going on, right there. The prison. Here we bring people that have issues with interpersonal relationships. Uh, people here fail at basic human interactions, so please be careful. Wait. Uh, uh, no, please. Don't believe any of her lies, stranger. I know the truth about this place. She won't let you out. She'll keep torturing you until she becomes bored. This floor is not a prison. This is where she puts her broken toys. If you leave now, you'll avoid becoming freaks like us. You'll have much more luck finding a way out as a normal human. Let's trade places. Well, everything here is said at the lie except for the last part. It is possible to trade your place in the elevator with the one our employees. People in other floors would never give their jobs, but the troublemakers here are different. Nishishishish. Lies, lies, all lies. You have to trust me, stranger. I don't want... I don't want what happened to me happened to you i'm in the elevator i can get revenge on her and you you can get away from her it's a win-win but i like her she's cute uh, i'd rather be with a cute girl than whatever you are we're done here i think it's time to leave this place now just trade places with me uh stay on the elevator you fool you not seen what she really is. Oh, she's a, she's a little she's a little demon devil girl. I you know, so like again, these are all different parts of hell, and I'm pretty sure that was the part of hell of lies. Because remember, I think the most farthest part of hell, like most deepest level, is like deceit. You know, I'm trying to remember because I've played um, Dante's Inferno, so I'm trying to remember that. But you know, I think that's actually how it goes. I think, I think, I think. But no, she's even cuter as a devil. I know, hell takers have changed my idea of how cute devil girls can be. I'll assume you've already figured it out. I did already figure it out. This is all the different levels of hell. That's right, you're already dead. Right now, you're going deeper and deeper into layers of hell. Trying to find which one is most appropriate for you. Our next stop is very special. Maybe you'll even find it a bit familiar. I mean, it's the 69 level was, you know. Here we are. This is our last stop. Uh, well, let me welcome you to hell. That's right, just hell. Every floor we have visited thus far is also part of hell. This one, however, is very special. You can call it the... The Christian hell or the movie hell or basically what you imagine what you're thinking of this place. Lava, sulfur, agony, all the good stuff. This 
<laughs> this floor is sort of a VIP lounge. All of our most disgusted guests stay here. Uh, uh Adolf, Walt, Walt, the 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 Kims, the Kim Kardashians, I guess. Even the failed clones, Mr. Jobs, the gang's all here. The failed clones, Mr. Jobs. Oh wow. Do you think you have the pedigree to join such selected group of evil? Well, I'll be the judge of that. Well, I think... I think I guess not. I guess I'm good. That you don't deserve to be here. You're actually way worse than everyone on this floor. You make me sick. Oh no! We're going to full speed to the very bottom of hell. Oh no! That's the only place where you deserve to be. Deeper, deeper, deeper we go. To the very bottom of hell. Last layer of damnation we go. Oh no. Huh? Here we are. We've gone so deep that we somehow return to the starting point. Don't ask me how that works. I don't know either. <laughs> now, this is the last layer of hell. Ha! <laughs> it's Earth! Let me welcome you to Earth. That's the last. So Hell has been living the entire time, apparently. That's right. This door leads to the worst possible outcome of all. You'll be reborn and have to go through the entire lifetime in a horrible world of yours. My oh my oh my Satan! I'm surely glad not to be in your shoes right now. Oh look how cute she is. She's so freaking cute. Now please. Get the beep out of my elevator and go be a sinking baby. See you in 80 years or so. Bye bye. Bye bye. All right. Well, that's elevator. Um, eight. Oh, cool. So there's different eight. There's different endings. All right. That's cool. I like that. That was fun. That was fun. It's a free to play game. You can actually download it for free just by I think looking at on it. Um, I might actually put it on YouTube. So maybe I'll actually do that for you guys. Um, but that's cool. I like that. That's cool. And it starts up all brand new. So we already know this. So that was cool. I like that. That was fun. That was fun. I like that a lot. Um, cool. Um, I always want to try that game. So I'm actually glad we actually did try it out. Now maybe I'll post that on YouTube later um, for you guys to check it out. Um, but yeah, maybe I even will get the link of that game in the description. So you guys can check it out if you want to. But yeah, that is Elevator. Pretty good. A lot of like thoughtful thinking about going on with it. And there's multiple endings apparently. So you can definitely get into a lot of the different endings of the game. Um, try it out. Let me know what kind of endings you guys get. I would actually really appreciate checking it out. Uh, I know I, I went through the endings of like, I, I think I got the best ending because, you know, instead of going through the stereotypical hell, um, I actually was able to go back back and get reincarnated, so I call that a win, you know? Again, another chance at life, it would actually be kind of nice. Um, it was way better than, you know, any of the other rooms. Well, I guess it could have done Sloth Room or something like that. But yeah, I do like how all the rooms are different kind of levels of hell. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure the choices I could have made could have changed up a little bit. I wonder if there's a way I could just went to heaven, I wonder. Again, try it out. Let me know what you guys get when you guys play the game. But yeah, let's support these guys. This is, this is adorable. This is, it was free to play a game. And yeah, I'd like to see more of it. But yeah, um, check out more of my videos whenever you get a chance. I'm going to end the stream right in here. Um, I definitely enjoyed our little like chat we had. And if you guys want to check out more of my chats, I'm going to probably do these every Thursday on Twitch for you guys. For my YouTube audience who gets all the way to this part of the uh, video, um, watch my streams and we do le uh, trying to laugh challenge. More of these kind of interesting kind of games, maybe. And then also, I was thinking about doing a tier list and do some more tier list videos. So definitely check it out. But right now, I hope you guys all have yourself a nice day and thank you for watching. And hopefully, see you guys in my next streams or check out my next videos. <laughs>